at range landing kicks. He's just constantly putting damage on you. Top, bottom, up, low, it does not matter. This guy is a dominant striker. One of the best kickboxers the UFC has ever seen. And in terms of the punching technique and the jab, as good as anyone in this division. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique, because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out O2 Arena in London, England, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves as we can fight. fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist, but on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of this. Really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Let's go straight down the middle. That was awesome. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Lee's kick to the body here. That one appeared to be blocked. Oh, nice straight punch there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good rebound. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. He's like in a zone. It's like the basketball hoop becomes twice its size. This guy today at focus minutes in his opponent. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? He loaded up on that right hand too. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering, nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Three minutes. Head kick. Punch over the top. Ooh, what a head kick. Oh, and 
there he goes working off that jab again. How's your jab? I mean, the jab's nice. I love throwing the jab. But you realize that as MMA evolves, guys will start to fight behind a very educated jab. It's just like boxing. The most thrown punch, and the first one you learn is a jab. Right. And in MMA, guys are starting to take that same approach because it is such an effective weapon. Big punch lands through the middle. Blocks the shot. And both guys really throwing with authority. Beautiful body kick. He's looking to land the right just out of range. Shot is blocked there by Lee. Caught that. No, there's danger in that too because when you start reaching on to catch that kick, here comes the high kick and then you're in a lot of trouble. Good punch lands. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Straight right hand now just misses. Beautiful body kick. Oh, how about this kicking game on full display tonight? Kicks back to back just truly mixing up the target. Sight to behold. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. Oh, big punch land. Now he's got him hurt very badly. What a tricky head kick. Oh, beautiful technique to land the overhand. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. That one stuck in. Nice strike. Punch coming, it's blocked. Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next Let's round. Go. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Misses with that punch. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Beautiful strike. Nice sneaky head kick. Oh, huge block. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Unable to connect with the right. Big body kick lands. Andy lands the knee to the body now. Sneaky head kick. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Just out of range with that strike. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab is working 
so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. That's a big strike right there. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Head kick lands. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? Big head kick land. Oh, big right hook, but a whiff. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, man, head kick land. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Oh, bucket in there. Beautiful shot to the body. Straight punch lands. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round, no denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Nice knee to the body by Lee. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Thirty seconds to go in the round. Great punch landed with so much power. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Left hand is true. That will absolutely work. He throws it like a piston back and forth. He's landing that beautiful left hand. Straight right is there. Cable inches right there. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. All right, let's get you some highlights from that previous round, DC. I don't care how strong your core is, you can't take too many more of those body kicks. John, you can't train for that. I mean, you cannot train to take those types of body kicks. They start to really wear at your gas tank, and then you start to make mistakes. When you take that many body kicks, you start making mistakes, and before you know it, the fight's over. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their toll. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Nice strike. Oh, that's the How 
his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Look at the turnover in that kick. Nice head kick. There's no kill on that leg kick. Nice loop and punch. Yes, now you heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Look at the force behind that leg kick. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. It's a beautiful, fast, quick jab with meaning. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Well, earlier in the round, he clearly got stung by his opponent, but he just has not responded well at all. He hasn't responded well. He hasn't gotten himself back going after getting hurt so bad early in the round. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Lee's shot is blocked. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Slips. Nice kick landed there by Lee. All right, so there he goes, continuing to land that jab. When they put this highlight together, it's just gonna be one head snapping back. It's gonna be boxers going back and watching this guy going, wow, this is what a jab is supposed to look like. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC, connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Lee's uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there. It closed quickly. Liver kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Cable inches right there, yeah. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Ooh, what a punch. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Powerful leg kick lands. Final seconds of round three. All right, lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. 
Ortiz's uppercut is blocked. Nice punch, Lance. Lance flush with that right hand. Over and over, he landed a big body kick. Oh, a nice slip, and then the counter fall. Oh, where is he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. He's in a good flow right now. He's landing big shots to the body. Big knee to the body! Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Look at him chopping the wood. He's chopped the wood with those leg kicks. All right, so he lands another punch there, and he smells blood in the water going right back at that cut. Absolutely. The opponent has a lot of scar tissue around the eyes. He was able to cut it open, and now he's just touching it over and over again. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Head kick. Nice punch there. Lee's knee attempt here looked like a good one, but it gets blocked. Oh, man, I'm, I'm just so glad that front kick didn't hit me. Kind of felt like it did. Right in the sternum. Your opponent come forward, you drive the ball of your foot into your opponent's sternum and hope to really affect the breathing. How about that shin? That was a thudding leg kick. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, he really is trying to get damage off every time he throws this punch. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Nice punch there by Lee. Leg kick. Oh, well, you can't enter the pocket there unprotected. You got to figure out a way to get your guard up a little bit. Another kick lands to the head there. And let's see if he and his corner can make the proper adjustments defensively to avoid any further head kicks here in this fight. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Big kick lands. Just over two minutes now to go. What a punch. Great upper body movement defensively. Slips another strike there. And offensively, he hasn't been a world beater, but defensively, he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent. Not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away. But that's a testament to the head movement and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Nice kick. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh, big head kick. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Checks the leg kick. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Can't take many of those, you better check. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. Ooh, nice, nice right hand. Let's go, Push, push, push. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. Hands higher, hands higher. Ooh, what a punch. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, looking to land the leg kick. That one checked. 10 seconds to go in the round. Oh, nice right Back hand. and forth we go. One-two punch. All right, no telestrator for the champ tonight, but that's okay. He'll still talk you through the replays. Body kicks for days, man. I mean, body kicks for days, but I got to be honest, John. If we don't incorporate a telestrator <laughs> into this game, 
This may be my only version of EA UFC. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Big body kick. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Nice defense there, huge block. throwing both sides with conviction. Good punch. The right hand just misses. Nice body kick. Big kick lands. Really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh, big head kick land. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Attempts the front kick there. Well timed knee to the body. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. It's such a fast leg kick. That punch, no good. Under three minutes now to go round five. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Nice kick. Head kick, big punch land. Ooh. Kick to the body by Lee. And once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. All right, it's late in the fight now. I don't need to be a judge to tell you that he is clearly losing. What is a fighter's mentality when you know you need a move? Oh, just digs his spot. High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Lee. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Big kick lands. there and certainly making good use of what is an obvious edge in reach. Take a deep breath. There's no tell on that leg kick. Come on, buddy, keep your hands up. Oh, landing a punch with the left hand. Wow! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. to the body there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, he's had that jab in his opponent's face all night long as he lands another one there. DC, I know you wish you had reached like this. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, oh, kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick he did not recognize it. Nice. Oh, thunder 
first leg kick rounds his opponent tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. So a lot to like over the distance of that fight tonight. Clearly, we think we saw one guy win the fight and largely got it done with the striking. Yeah, he got it done with the striking. And that's exactly what he's known for. He's known as a guy that's so comfortable whenever he's in the stand-up. And that showed tonight as he truly outworked his opponent. All right, the official decision is now in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest, 50-45. And the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon!